There is simply no stopping Marcus Rashford right now. Ten years since former Manchester United captain Wayne Rooney scored in six consecutive Premier League home games, Rashford repeated the feat by netting his 20th goal of the season in all competitions during Wednesday night's 2-2 draw with Leeds United. After finding themselves 2-0 down just three minutes into the start of the second half, Rashford connected with Diogo Dalot's cross to head home and kick start the Reds' recovery. Not only did his header mark his sixth goal in as many Old Trafford outings in the Premier League and his 20th goal of the campaign, but it also marked his second goal in the space of just five days, following his strike against Crystal Palace on Saturday, which was also scored in the 62nd minute. After starting the evening on the right wing, as a result of Alejandro Garnacho starting in place of the injured Antony, Rashford moved out to the left and then into the middle once Woot Weghorst was taken off and replaced by Jadon Sancho, who went on to score the equaliser. It means manager Eric Ten Hag could find it difficult where best to place Rashford in Sunday's reverse fixture against Leeds at Elland Road. His best form this season, just as it has for most of his career, has come when he has operated on the left of the front three. Though he has delivered the goods this season, United have become over-reliant on him and desperately need a world-class striker to lead the line and share some of the goal-scoring burden. If Rashford was to pick up an injury between now and the end of the season it is a situation that doesn't bear thinking about. But although United desperately need to add a new out-and-out out striker to their ranks in the summer, Rashford, with the exception of last season's struggles, has now scored 20 goals or more in three of the last four seasons in all competitions. He scored 22 goals in 2019-20, notched 21 goals in 2020-21 and has 20 to his name already this season. Including last season's paltry tally of 5, he has now scored 68 goals since the beginning of the COVID hit 2019-20 campaign. It is a respectable tally for someone who is not considered as a natural number 9. Rashford, whose 20 goals this season have been made up of a wide array of finishes, including well-taken efforts at the end of counter-attacking runs, strikes from outside the penalty area and firm, no-nonsense headers, as a result of his exploits in recent seasons, has become the first United player since Sir Alex Ferguson retired in 2013 to score 20 goals or more in three separate seasons. Admittedly, up until this season's resurrection under Ten Hag, United had been on a decline since Ferguson's retirement, making it hard for any player to regularly smash their way through the 20-goal barrier. Therefore, Rashford's achievement of doing so should not be overlooked or go unnoticed. After the way last season went for the 25-year-old, few would have given him a chance by hitting 20 goals this season, let alone by early February. He has been in sensational form since returning from the World Cup in Qatar, scoring 12 goals in just 14 matches to increase his tally at a rapid rate of knots. His exploits since the December restart mean that he is now just three goals away from enjoying his best season in front of goal of his career so far. Although nothing can be guaranteed in football, you would have to search hard to find good odds on him not reaching 23 goals by the end of the campaign. His numbers, particularly at Old Trafford this season, where he has scored 15 of his 20 goals, make incredibly impressive viewing, even if United, without him, would be in trouble. Ten Hag has had an enormous impact on him and Rashford is now repaying his manager by smashing through barriers and being within touching distance of a new personal milestone.